Welcome to the prayer to boldly step into the presence of God and ask Him to meet a need. This is a prayer I've put together where I'd like to pray for anyone within the sound of my voice. All I ask you to do is to agree with me as I pray, and together we will seek our Heavenly Father. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we gather together and come into agreement in the wonderful and powerful name of Jesus Christ. Where two or more gathered, there you'll be in the midst of us. And anything we agree upon is touching, you will surely do. Father, in Jesus' name, there's no distance in the Spirit. And we thank you for the person I'm praying for, who desires a prayer to boldly step into your presence and ask that you meet a need. Father, the enemy would like nothing more than for them to fear that their needs and wants will never be met, that their situation will never get better, that you are withholding your goodness towards them. Lies. They are all lies from the enemy, and we bind and rebuke them in Jesus' name. Please help them to put and keep their trust in you, to trust your promises in the face of circumstances that would say you are unfaithful. Please remind them to keep your word before their eyes and in their heart. As they renew their mind, you will bring the harvest. As they keep their trust in you, everything will work together for good. You watch over your promises to bring them to pass in the lives of those who have their faith in you and are patient. We bind the spirit of fear and rebuke it right now in Jesus' name. Worry, fear, anxiety, go now. Father, thank you for allowing them to step into your presence whenever they want. Through Christ, they have free access to you. You are their father and they are your child. You love them beyond what they can comprehend in this lifetime, and you always want to provide what they need and what they want. Right here and now, we come into agreement and ask you to meet every need and want that they have that is in alignment with your plan for their life. Praise you and thank you, Lord, for answering the requests of the person I'm praying for. You are so good. We decree and declare that they do not have a spirit of fear, but a spirit of power, love, and a sound mind that trusts in you. We decree and declare that they have a newfound boldness to go to you with anything that is on their heart. They can freely make the requests known to you with thanksgiving. Praise you that as they spend genuine time in your presence, they can be open and honest about how they feel and what they believe is needed and even wanted. You are a good, good, loving Father. You gave them Jesus. How much more freely do you give them all other things that are asked for with the right motives? Hallelujah. Thank you for listening to them and for speaking to them as they allow time for you to instruct them. You said in your word that they can come boldly. You said in your word that if they abide in you and your words abide in them, that they can request what they need and want and you'll provide. Hallelujah. They will continually make the request boldly, with reverence, with the right motives, with thanksgiving, and with a willingness to make adjustments if you say so. They are so grateful for all that you do for them. Glory to your name. The person I'm praying for will never hesitate to come to you and to ask for what they need and want to overcome any situation they step into. And as they do, they will have an abundance of fruit from answered prayer about their needs and wants that give you all the praise, glory, and honor. We believe and receive everything we've prayed and give you glory in advance for this prayer is answered. In the wonderful and precious name of Jesus we pray. Amen. For more Christian prayers, visit dailyeffectiveprayer.com.